Yet again, gas prices have hit an all-time high, and analysts say we could see five bucks a gallon later this month. But gas prices aren't the only economic fear. Lauren Blanchard has more from Washington. $140 to fill up my van. That's crazy. Drivers are frustrated as the U.S. reaches another new record on gas prices. Nationally, on average, you'll pay $4.67 a gallon, according to AAA. Burning wallets as summer travel heats up and inflation remains high. President Biden says he wants to give the Federal Reserve space to carefully bring inflation down. They have a laser focus on addressing inflation, just like I am. But the administration is facing criticism for not anticipating the rise in prices on just about everything, and it shows no sign of slowing down. In 2021, Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen said inflation posed a small risk. Others in the administration said the inflation would be short term. She's walking that back now. I think I was wrong then about um, the path that inflation um, would take. There have been a huge series of shocks um, to the economy that we didn't anticipate. Former Treasury Secretary Larry Summers says the Fed will likely continue to hike interest rates in June and July, possibly more. And even then, a recession could still be on the way. Right now, inflation is well above 4% and unemployment is properly measured well below 4%. Gas prices aren't dropping anytime soon. Gas Buddy analysts believe by June 17th, gas could hit $5 a gallon on average. In Washington, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.